All right, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Today we're doing the famous water balloon in a flask demonstration to try to illustrate Charles' law. Step one of the lab is you will come back, measure out 30 milliliters of water, and put it in the flask. You'll then place the flask on the ring stand, light your fire, and slide that under there so the water begins to heat. We want to bring it to a boil, and then you return to your seat, and we will be discussing Charles' law for a while until we move on to phase two. Okay, so the water's been boiling a while now. So again, most of the air has been pushed out of the flask by the steam. Steam is, of course, gaseous water. So now we're going to take our balloon and place it not side down over the opening. We might see it dancing around a little bit as the escaping hot gases are pushing it up. And now we're going to very carefully with the tongs set it in the container of cold water. And we'll see if as the cold gases contract, if the balloon will go down into the flask. If you're able to successfully complete that without breaking the balloon or any other problems, then you'll pick up some extra credit and you'll pick up, more importantly, knowledge on the fact that hot gases expand, cold gases contract.